Let's go, thank you. Yo, 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 familia, yo, yo, welcome back, welcome back, welcome back to the Infinity Kingdom video with Senku from Server 66, welcome back, familia, today's video, guys, we're gonna talk about this new Immortal, well, it's not new anymore, but it's one of the latest for Shadow, and he has really impressed me a lot, and we're gonna go through it, because this Immortal is really, really, really strong, and his name is Tutankhamun. So before we start, let's watch his his intro because I never watch his intro. So let's go. Look at that. He opened the oof. Look at that. Now you're coming up like square. It's a little bit, a little bit. Uh, they could do something more in that intro. It's a little bit like boring, but it's not really like something really fancy. You know, but it's all right. So this is the immortal. This is Tutankhamun, which is a shadow a sperman immortal in a shadow team, right? So this immortal is um the only way you're gonna be able to unlock it is by it says Taya's roulette, but also we're gonna be able to unlock this immortal with this um spark of galaxy. As you can see, it's gonna come here and you're gonna be able to purchase those um pearls, or you're gonna be able to spend some uh, gems on it in order to achieve um this immortal, right? And the good thing about the spares sparks of galaxy, you're gonna also get the immortals, and also you're gonna get his exclusive artifact, which is really 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 nice so we're gonna go through his exclusive artifacts and we're gonna go through open arena to see what uh, his exclusive artifact actually does right it says uh when the when the rat of Horus deals double damage it unleashes dark balls to two random enemy units with 65 chance to stun them for three seconds all right so uh this is basically what it does it actually uh, we will be able to stun the immortals which is not really a big thing but uh, that's his exclusive artifacts. Okay, so we're gonna read this. We're gonna read this guy's skills first to see what he does. Um, sorry. So, unleash five waves of energy to random to random enemies dealing physical damage. Damage rate seventy five percent, and he's going up to two fifty. Right. When damaging an enemy that is affected by bleed or tear, Tutankhamun will have seventy uh, percent. Chances to recover 2% of his maximum troops. When the same tag is hit within 1.5 seconds, the damage is doubled. So basically, it unleashes five waves. And if basically if one immortal will suffer uh, the same blade twice, it's the same wave twice, basically that it will receive the double the double damage, right? So it will receive 500. Remember, it, it, it unleashes five waves and there is only four immortals. So one of them for sure will receive a double and if in the case if more than if he's missing someone and then two of them uh, and receive doubles that will be 500 percent damage for those immortals that receive double the waves which is really really a lot all right and then we're gonna we're gonna go through what skills are actually the best for this immortal because this immortal right tutankhamun really really impressed me a lot and impressed me a lot in the open arena Thanks for the open arena, we are allowed to actually test some immortals. And let me tell you something, this guy is crazy good, right? This guy is crazy good. And this skill is on him. Oh my God. Listen, this guy is just so good, right? This skill is one of the most fundamental, Blade Vortex. Because remember, Blade Vortex will boost the skill. Thank you, thank you, man, skill because Blade Vortex will, 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 um, will make the enemy will suffer from tear effect. Uh, taking physical damage up to 150 and also um, um, damage 150 for random enemies. Okay, every 12 seconds after the battle start, cause physical damage uh, up to 150 to three random enemy units. Upon a successful hit, the enemy will suffer from tear effect, taking physical damage up to 150. So remember that if the enemy suffers from tear of bleed, as you can see there, tear on bleed, it will um, uh, have 70 chance. To recover two two two, two, two percent uh, maximum troops and also if receive the damage in the so basically what it will do what we will do basically a uh, blade vortex it will give him some healing so he will recover uh, two percent of his uh, uh, maximum troops which is really really good 
right and then you have executing it which affect inflicting continuous damage eight times deal additional physical damage uh, 350 to the entire enemy team and gain execution effect increasing the damage deal to the target with less than 30 percent by 50 percent um for six seconds all right so this this uh, skills i didn't know it was work it was gonna work that well on tankamon but it actually works very 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 good i think the second the, the first one that the first immortal that works the best is um the cow's immortal um which is poseidon and then the second immortal that works the best is to tank Amon, right that skill just works really really good and we're gonna go and see some reports if we can actually see some reports from from him all right so here we see uh I'm a, i have to tank Amon here and here is it is one million the battle only lasts for 26 seconds so executing it will do more in the long term battles right so in this case it did as you can see 5 million secretioner and then it also did um secretioner blade voltage yeah so executing it did only uh, i see well, only it did almost 6 million damage right which is a really 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 good amount of damage and the skill is using obviously is the same as i do uh, demonic contract blade vortex and executing it which is doing really nice damage we're gonna go and see about it against murphy here we're gonna see that's mine that's his he did 8.7 million executed damage which is insane mine did um blade vortex did the most executing it only did 2 million so here you can see let's see against uh its opponent here we can see my executor did um 4.7 damage in this in this case right but you can see how that skill just works so good on on um on tutankhamon right it works so well so he did uh executing a 4.7 millions right you can see it does really really good amount of damage so that skill is just so so good on tutankhamon it doesn't work as well as blade voice because blade voice is just so op but it's still very very good and sometimes like as you can see guys he deals a lot of, a lot of damage right so let's see this this uh, this one here here it does uh, 4.7 million uh five attempts right so you, you can see how it's got consistency consistency a lot of, a lot of damage here you can you're gonna see here uh four millions also here we're gonna see um 6.8 million so that skill does really really good damage and uh, there is no let me see if there is any against poseidon i'm not sure if there is anyone using poseidon here there is some people using poseidon but i don't think i actually faced them uh so far let me see if i put let me see if there is any poseidon here i think there is a, there is one using poseidon but i can't remember which one is it right there is someone using poseidon but i can't remember which one is it right let me see if if, if i use poseidon no so as you can see mainly the arena is 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 leading by shadow there is a venge which is used holy let me see venge go venge 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 here uh he is poseidon as you can see here we obviously the same as skills as you can see and he just did so good he just did so good look 4.9 almost 5 million damage so he is really really good let me see i should have let me see if i got any any defeat against venge because i really want to see uh, this guy in action but now there is no more so this guy guys is so good right and those skills on him just work so perfectly you know and i will anybody running shadow anybody running shadow right siegfried is just take it off you know simple siegfried just take him off if you have siegfried guys just take him off and go and take take him off just straight away just like i know you don't like spearman but forget about don't like him spearman if you got siegfried just take him off take him off and straight away and make sure you use to and come on because this guy is insane this guy is just so good is so good and i like him and i wanted to make a video about it those are the three skills that works the best on him or you know the best of the best and if you can unlock this skill now on the trees if, if on the trees you know if you're looking for him these are the best skill for to tank a mom 
So that's it for this video. That's the tank I'm on. I hope you guys enjoy it. Subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye bye. Peace out.